Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to top up or change your front transfer case oil in an Evo 10. So uh, let's go over to the car and I'll show you what we've got to do. Okay, so before we actually go to the car, we need to make sure we've got the right oil. Now you can't just use any old gearbox oil, you've got to use the right stuff because these uh, transfer cases, um, they've got clutch packs in and they have certain friction modifiers and there's all sorts of complicated reasons why you have to use the right oil. Now this is the oil that I'm using, it's what a lot of people in the UK use because this oil is made in Britain. Um, so that's the oil that you want to use. You're going to need a special tool, something like this, because the way that you fill the transfer case is not, you can't do it through gravity really, you have to pump it up through a syringe. Now let's have a look under the car and I'll show you the transfer case. Now here we have the transfer case, so if you look at the front of the car here, here we have the engine, at the back then is the transfer case. Now this big bolt here, that is your drain plug. So you undo that to remove the oil out of the transfer case. If we follow the transfer case up here, there's a bolt there and if I zoom in, it actually says oil on the bolt. So that's a 17 mil and that's your fill bolt. Now in this case, I don't need to drain the oil because it's already empty. But for me now, I'm going to take off that 17 mil bolt and then we're going to fill it with oil. So let's do it. Okay, so I've just loosened the bolt. There's quite a lot of torque on this, so I used a, an eight point socket and um, this big ratchet here to get a nice clean bit of torque on it. So we'll undo that bolt now and then we'll fill it up with oil. Okay, so here's the oil. Um, as I said, you are not going to get it in there without this type of tool. So what we're going to do now, you just place it in and then you gently bring up all the gearbox oil like that. Defoil them. Once it's full, now we've got to go under the car. Okay, so the tube's in the hole. So we're just going to push up the fluid. We know when it's full because liquid will start to come out. It'll probably take about a litre, I think. So I don't think it's going to be overflowing on the first go. Five watt 19. Here we are. So we got it, if you can see there. It's pouring now out of the hole. So we know, because that is the fill hole, that the oil level's where it needs to be. So just to confirm, I'll put another little squirt in and it's just started pouring out again. So we know it's at the right level. So I'll take that out now. Yeah, when, when that stops dripping, it's time to put the plug back in. Is that the horsepower would this be then? Maximum, do you think? Well, wow. let's get out of that engine with all the work you've done. Well, it's a case of how hard you want to push it more than anything. Could do up to a thousand. There's a zoom on it, isn't it? Right, so I'm going to torque the fill plug to 23 foot pounds, which is not a lot at all. So, if you, if you haven't got a torque wrench, just use common sense. It's, just, it's quite tight, but not, don't go levering on it, basically. There we are not tight at all. So that's how you do your transfer case oil on an Evo 10. Now if you want to see more of the Evo, check out my other videos. I've been making videos on this car for nearly four years now, so uh, I'm sure there's something you'll like. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.